some love, champ, peace for it. Just a bro. What up, y'all? It's your boy, Matt Big Body Cool Ray, man. I'm out here, my nigga Q Wilson, y'all. Oh, yeah, another subscriber, you know. Oh, he been on the team, man. This is years in now. Oh, he tried to practice. I tried to straight trucks. You know, we out here on our New York shit. We on our way to New York City. My nigga gotta go get some documents before he go into the military. Um, just putting a video together here, something light and delicate. Want to give a shout out to Leon Jones, 411 Talks on Radio. Leon, what up, nigga? <laughs> what up, Leon? We out here, man. You still hold it together, man. Hold it down, man. We waiting on you, baby. Shout out to my man, B-Hack. Shout out to my man, Warren Williams. Shout out to my man, Ahmed Osiris. Shout out to my man, Earl from Sacramento. Shout out to my man, Mark from the job. Shout out to my man Marco from Indiana. Man, shout out to everybody that subscribed to me that fucks with me. I fucks with you and I love y'all niggas, man. And shout out to the motherfuckers breaking the law, man. man fuck the world, fuck the government, this world ain't shit. But, uh, anyway. <laughs> let's talk about it, man. So, the incident happened in Pittsburgh the other day, right? Um... Chicks got beat up by these Arab dudes that ran a gas station. So, you know, black people, you know, we be on our niggas shit. Somebody gotta come out there, hold out, hold the phone and record the shit while these sisters are getting jumped. So, you know, me, I'm type motherfucker, I ask myself shit like this. Well, what caused them to get their ass with? I don't, I don't look at that because they females. Niggas should be punching on them. Well, what caused them to get punched on? That's what, I'm, that's what I'm looking at. So, you know, I'm looking at the nature of the area, which is Pittsburgh. For those who don't know, Pittsburgh's a little, Pittsburgh's a little rough. Pittsburgh got some niggas out there. Um, but I'm also looking at how the the, 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 the the temperament of the females are very niggerish, ghetto-ish. And, uh... It was told that that the uh, late the young lady did wanted a refund because the pump wasn't working for the gas. Now, I highly doubt that was the issue that got her punched on. Cause I know niggas. Cause I be on my nigga shit myself sometimes. So more than likely, most likely, she probably got smart or disrespected the man. And you know, them Arabs, man, them motherfuckers stick together, man. They're, they're one of them, them, them people, you know, other than, you know, us black people don't stick together, man. All the cultures and races stick together but us, man. Man, they laid the fucking mittens down on them, man. Her and her little bitch boy G.I. Joe girlfriend, you know, chick was on some dyke shit, thinking she was a man, and got the man handed to her. You know what I'm saying? But see, what I'm getting to is this. Motherfuckers out there protesting and all this, what this Black Lives Matter, you know, and all that stupid shit. All lives matter. But what about when you acting a fucking fool? You know, is it is it supposed to be ignored that your you, your behavior needs to be corrected? Is it because you're a female, a motherfucker shouldn't have to correct you? Because my thing is like this. I don't give a fuck with you, male, female, god, or dog. No, sh nobody should be disrespecting anybody. Yeah. And if you disrespect somebody, then you deserve to get addressed yeah, or dealt with. Exactly. If you come correct, you get dealt with correctly, man. See, motherfuckers, you know, motherfuckers put that. Uh, and this is what I gotta teach my daughters. Like, it's not because you're a female, guy shouldn't hit you. There's no guy, and no female, nobody should hit anybody. So the, cause the moment you, you, the moment when you start to think, cause you're a female, God shouldn't be hitting you, you're gonna think, like, okay, in your mind's like, well, I'm a female, God shouldn't hit me, but I, I can hit a guy and get away with it, and that's not the case. We don't even want you to get to that comfort zone. So, in this case, when it comes down to respect level, you get respect, you get respect. You act the ass, you get your ass handed to you. So no, I don't have no sympathy for them bitches that got beat up at the gas station. 
And I can almost guarantee you, they did some shit to get what the fuck they got. And so for them to even slap them, well, fuck them up that hard, they must have really did something. Man, he threw that bitch to the gas pump. He said, fuck what you heard. Hey, my name is Matt Big Body Cole. You can call me at 856-507-3604. I'm giving you my take on how I feel about that Pittsburgh shit. And let's talk about it. You can call me up. You can cuss it out. We can cuss it out. We can fuss it out. But I stand where I stand on my shit, man. And how I feel about it is, y'all niggas be on the bullshit, man. So don't be surprised when somebody bring it back to you, man. It's like if I'm out here acting a fool, saying and doing what I want to do, and somebody checks me, hey, I bought that, you know? I bought that. I can't sit here and act like I'm in the right when I'm really in the wrong, you know? So, and you know, some people say, well, you don't know what happened because you didn't see the whole shit from the beginning when they were in the store. You only caught the part from the outside when somebody was recording. I can almost guarantee you them nigga bitches was acting a fucking fool. Because one thing I know for sure about true Muslims, Islam, true, true Muslims, they're humble. They're very humble. It takes a lot to take them there. They, 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 they move off of being, off of humility and, 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 and practicing uh, on, on, you know, just, just carrying themselves in a very relaxed manner. But they ain't, they human too. They ain't got time for the bullshit. They don't. They don't. You know, and you disrespect the motherfucker, you gonna get what comes with it, man. It's just that simple, man. I'm not gonna sit here and sugarcoat shit and, oh, no. Yeah, nah, fuck all that, man. Fuck all that. But, um, I said, man, 856-507-3604. Like, sus- subscribe, share. I'm not asking for no money, so you ain't gotta donate shit. I don't want your money. You ain't gotta PayPal me. You know, it's just simple video for dialogue, man. Hey, you can call in if you want, and I'll bust it up with you. You disrespect me, I'm gonna disrespect you back. You talk civil and cordial, I talk civil and cordial back with you. But best believe, everybody has entitled to their own opinion, so I'm gonna say something that you might not like. You're gonna say something that I might not like. But oh well, it's just the way the world works. It is what it is. But um, to those females that got their ass whooped at the gas station, you're lucky they didn't tie y'all the fuck up and lock the doors. You're lucky they didn't call a fucking holy jihad and blow that motherfucker up with everybody around it. See, y'all motherfuckers are so quick to want to react, but don't look at certain circumstances. You don't think outside the box. These mo- these motherfuckers have no problem killing themselves and people around them for what they stand for and believe in. True that. So why the fuck would you piss one of them the fuck off? Why? When they could do something as simple as blow the whole fucking gas station up and everybody around them. And they self. Come on, man. Wake up, man. Think. This shit right here is a big body production. My man Q Wilson in the building. We're going to New York City. You look good, you, you look good enough, you can see it in the background. We're on the Jersey Turnpike. And uh, that's just it is what it is, man. We out. We out here, man. Later, y'all.